Hi guys, welcome back. We are continuing playing Little Misfortune, and my name is Moo, and we just went down into Benjamin's basement. Let's go. Let's see what we can find here. Oh, what's this? There's a hole behind the painting. Hello? Are we going I here? I can't reach it. I'm a little lady, you know. Uh, can I take the, this one? Oh no, is this... Benjamin. Oh no, is this Benjamin? What? Uh -huh. think... Such a clever little lady. Yes, you are. There we go. Time to use my ninja skills. I'm slightly worried. Shh, what a bad crack. Be quiet. This is a ninja mission. Bad humor. Benjamin, are you here? So it was Benjamin placing these, but Benjamin seems so nice. Maybe he put them for that monster. Yep. Hmm, kind of fish balls? This is like fish balls. Oh, sorry. Hmm, kind of fish balls? This is like sushi balls. Not really, but yeah. What is this? Hmm, a picture of a key. Interesting. My ninja senses are telling me to climb up on this chair. Yes. Hmm, a real ninja lady always touches everything. <laughs> yes, she does. A secret button. Push the button, yeah. All right, then. I push the button. I wonder if I am leading the monsters to the children right now. What if I'm leading the monsters to monster to the children? That was easy. All right, time to find Benji. Oh. <laughs> oh, that was unfortunate. I hope things get better when I get the eternal happiness. Okay, Miss Fortune, let's finish this. Get up, Miss Fortune. What? You are stronger than you think. What? You've been knocked down before. What is this? Did you let that stop you? I Get feel misfortune. You can do it. Ah! Because. Because. You are the little lady misfortune. <laughs> okay. I'm still scared that we're actually leading the monster. Okay, I'm out again. Anyone here? Bungie? Mr. Voice? I guess I'm alone. Mmm. Oh, a baby deer. So sweet. And I get mm. to pet her. Dream come true. I'm petting the baby deer. <laughs> Wait, I can't... I can't sparkle this? Really? Oh, I thought I was gonna be able to sparkle it. One more try. Sparkle! Okay, no. Is oh, what is this? Benjamin's bag? Benjamin? Are you around? He must be in trouble. I am so scared. I'm very disappointed in you, Miss Fortune. Ah, uh, there you are. Hey, have you seen Benjamin? I think he's in trouble. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm very disappointed in you. Mr. Voice, please stop playing games. You have lied to me all the time and that's very sucky. I knew I couldn't trust you. What are you talking about? I read what Benjamin wrote in his diary. All of it. You're the one taking the children. 
And I... I'm not the hero of this game, right? I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. You can't make me. Yes, I can. Stop that. Then play with me. You need to find your eternal happiness. I'll give you a clue. It's at home, waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want hmm. it anymore. You can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. I won't tolerate this behavior. I don't I'm like it. Waiting for you at home. Now, tell me where Benjamin is. What did you do to him? Freaking monster. Let's see what's inside. Maybe a clue where to find Benjamin. I'm so scared about this. Oh, wait, hello. At the end of the road, you will realize you already signed the deal. Oh, damn it. At the end of the road, you will realize you already signed the deal. A deal, you said? Damn. Oh, that Benjamin is a baby. Oh, so cute. Cute. For students of the universe in their technology, Pro protect our course, three step guide, three step guide to exterminate parasitic beings from the beyond. As the ultra reality forms in hand with the concept of time, new realms outside of the constituted FREE, five realms of essential existence have appeared. After the ultra war, thousands of beings were discovered as a uh, byproduct of the war. They created themselves uh, a new realm they refer to as the beyond. Beyond this, in simple turn, a place of extreme absurdity with no logical laws and physics. We can't allow such things inside the free at the moment. Since the foundation of our reality is based in the energetic of ethical values of the ultra reality be uh, before the ultra war, the beyond is still misunderstood realm. We haven't yet found the pieces to connect it, connect within it in a logical manner. The few patterns we recognize are the behaviors of some vis visitors also known as parasites. They normally enter the third reality, aka Pandora, and seek fresh meat to lure into the beyond. Hold up. And that is why we need the protectors. The protectors are the only ones with the capa capability to seeing the imbalance between realities and using the tools available outside of the alter reality. Protectors would help victims to guide them into sensor D. The guidance provided in this book will be followed with great responsibility. Never skip a step. For each victim, the protector returns to sensor D. The protector will be rewarded with new levels, tools, and more steps to follow. The protector must locate the victims and the parasite. Protect this parasite case at... Yeah, Morgo. The guys we have. Evaluate if the victim is in need of assistance. If so, then step to, proceed to step two. Need of assistance checklist. The victim seems to have forgotten his or her identity. The victim is already dead but doesn't realize it. Or the victim believes the illusions of the beyonds are real. The victim sympathizes with the parasite. Morgo deforms uh, reality into absurdity. Parasite seems friendly, yet it lures the victim to play dangerous games. It shapeshifts into a human animal creature. It quickly learns about the environment, language, and culture are not an issue for this parasite. Large flocks of black birds will appear near the parasite. These birds are the eyes of Morgo, giving him an overview of his playing ground. Step 2. Use the surroundings to help the victim become aware of the parasite. The protector can, for example, write and paint simple messages in public spaces to increase awareness. It is strictly forbidden to interact directly with the victim. It could lead to irre irreversible trauma inside the victim's mind. If the parasite kills the victim, you need to proceed to step 3 immediately. Step 3. Prepare for direct contact with... Okay. Okay, we got that one. I'm, I'm still... I don't know if this is going to be a happy ending or not. Alright, hmm. I guess I'll take the train back home. Hmm. Aware. Now when I look at this, I can see what Benjamin tried to warn me about. Yeah, the Mura. Sather. Oh, what's that? Such a foxy boy. Nice. Okay. Fun means uh, okay, camp, basically. I'll wait here. Waiting, 
waiting for a little while. Is someone gonna pu come and okay. push her down? I'm gonna talk to myself. So, Miss Fortune, how have you been? Okay, I have this like weird day. I saw monsters, I saw dolls, I saw Benjamin, and then I went to the zoo and everything was everywhere. And then hmm. I realized Mr. Voice had lied to me a lot. And he took Benjamin, and now I'm alone. I don't like being alone. Wow, sounds Sorry. like you had one hell of a day, Miss Fortune. Hmm. The train is here. It was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You maybe considering her dysfunctional family, maybe... They would be s using that kind of language. Hiro! Kiri wa doko desu ka? Kiri! I don't know what Kiri is yet. I forgot. I keep on forgetting. Oh, hello. I am so good at painting. Oh, I, I don't need to worry. I can just like paint all over. It seems like. Nice. I can paint this one. I can do this. How much do I need to paint? I'm, I'm, I'm painting white with a green pen. Logic. I, I apparently I did bring some pens with me too. I'm actually decently staying within the lines. Good thing that the um, the game kind of helps me stay within the lines a bit. That is quite beneficial as I am not good at drawing with controllers. Uh, there we go. Oh. How do I... Oh, I can draw more! Hello, you're a red one. Okay. Were these actually red or am I just making it up? Like, I really don't know what colors dinosaurs were. I don't think anyone technically know. Probably. Maybe, maybe like the scientists and the um, paleontologists, I think they're called. I'm sure they are more aware of of that more than I am. Hey, it actually gives like on some places where I, where I run over it twice, it actually gets a little bit like uneven, so to speak. I think that's nice. There we go. Oh, I want to paint the butterfly. Painting the butterfly. And then this thing here. What, like, what if what if they would have actually like rainbow colors? That would be like super cool. Like, imagine rainbow colored uh, dinosaurs like everywhere. That would be so cool. Honestly. There we go. And then we go here. And here. And here. There we go. Yay! Uh, I don't feel inspired. Oh. Uh. Hello, Hiro. Hiro. I didn't recognize you. <laughs> Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. But I don't think it's a voice anymore. I'm sure it's the monster. I saw it in a book at Benjamin's place. Really creepy. Have you ever heard voices in your head? Consequence of... Be aware of the consequences. What does it mean? It's the monster! Leave Hero alone! Toskata! Toskata! Toskata, help me! Help Hero! Hero, hold my hand! Ah! Ah! No! Hero! Beware of the consequence. I know for <laughs> what. It's like everything that I do goes wrong anyway. I kill a fucking puppy. I kill the puppy. I'm not. I'm still upset about that. I hope I get to see Hiro again. Lisa, try to help him. Monster did to him. Uh, 
Now I have to walk all the way back home alone. This is the last time I follow a voice in my head. If Benjamin was here, I know. he would walk with me. Uh... Wait. At least I had fun at Phantasmagoria. <laughs> I'm gonna tell mommy about it. Okay, so I can only run it back and forth. Excuse me. I'm talking over here. Well, if that's how you treat little ladies, then give yourself a fuck. Hey, language. I don't like how they make an eight year old talk in that way. I honestly don't like it. Huh? Where's the car? Is Daddy gone again? Oh. The pool is gone. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I like them. I don't like this at all. Honestly. And then I'm walking straight into it. Really? Hello? Mommy? Bangi? What happened here? Congratulations. You reached the end of my game. Leave me alone. I'm looking for Mommy and Benjamin. There's no eternal happiness for you. I don't even no care shit. anymore. Of course you care. You know your mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. Yes, I guess you're right. No! Good, good. Ready for a new game? If I play alone, will you give me back Benjamin? I guess I will, but only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. Don't Splendid. do it, you little will misfortune. my new game. This is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you. Wait a minute. Didn't I do this already? What? No, you're not doing this correctly. Then you say something about me dying today, which is totally not true, by the way. <clears throat> Wait. Stop talking, please. Are we going to play another game, or is this like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. So and she's already yes, dead! And I say yes. Stop ruining this! Uh, eternal oh, she's happiness. already dead, but she doesn't realize One. it. Fantastic. Ready to... Wait, what? No deal. No. No. Uh, how about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin and you leaving me alone, I'll play along. Sure, sure. I promise. You know the way. If Mr. Voice scares me again, I'm gonna run and hide in here. Huh, is this a new dance song? Hmm. I have a little hunch that Mr. Voice is the monster in my closet. Definitely. Okay, I'm just gonna play this game one last time. Let's take a short little break here and I'll be right back. Thank you so much for watching my video. I really do appreciate that. And as usual, we're gonna end up with a very awkward dance. I'll see you. Bye.